Hi guys. Okay, keeping on track with your new team member. This is crucial. If you want to have any kind of success when it comes to building a team, you need to get yourself organised. So that's organising with where your team members are at, organising with being able to bring in your next team members and know where they're at, and just keeping yourself pretty much on track and also your team member, okay? So there's loads of things. Now, we have attached to this video a checklist, and this checklist is everything that you need to be doing step by step from the minute you get a registration link to email to say that you have a new team member. Okay, and the minute you do, you need to send them information. Now, you're going to find here in this checklist um, some message templates. Again, put your personality into that. It's just as an example. Some message templates for you to use to say, welcome to the team. This is what we're going to do with you. Now I'm going to do this with you. Now I'm going to do that with you. Go here, go there. So it's going to give you a step-by-step -step guide as to what to do next how to work with your people, how to encourage your people. And that's super, super important, okay? I really recommend that you build a relationship and get to understand your new team member, what they want, okay? A couple, a question that I think is really important to ask is, what do you want from this business other than money? Now, what I mean by that is, it doesn't have to be th that they want, you know, like uh, the community or the fund. It might be what the money gives them. So, for example, well, I need the money because I need to, I need to get out of um, this job that I'm in. I absolutely hate it. It might be that they need the money because they haven't, they've never been on holiday for three years and they're desperate to set the children on holiday. You know, so what is the money for? That kind of thing. And the reason why I ask you to do that is because once you know that, that is going to be something that's help, that's going to help you um, understand them, go forward, motivate them, inspire them on the off days. Because guys, we all know we have down days. Not everyone buys from us every day. Not everyone wants to join us all the time. We have the low days. And by having and understanding their motivation, that's going to help you help them in return. So it's super important that we keep a track on all of that. I recommend you having a little, maybe a little notepad or a little um, Excel sheet or whatever it is that you want to do where you've got bits of information on each for your team member. Things like the dates that they joined. When does their 90 days run out? When does their welcome program rewards run out? Is it their first chance? Can they get it again understanding all this stuff is going to is going to massively help you okay you want to nurture them you want to think of them as being your new little baby you're going to help them every step of the way you want to be the biggest cheerleader okay the biggest cheerleader so that you can recognize every step but what is important here is recognize every step for a for a, a good point so what i'm saying is if they post uh, on the, the the page you're not going to go a big recognition post oh my god they're posting the page and they do it again, you're like, oh my God, congratulations, they posted again. These are things that they have to just do on their own. But when you recognize things like, oh my God, you just hit your welcome program, you just got your first order, you just got your VIP, you just got your fast start bonus. Oh my God, you know how close you are to the next promotion. These are the kind of things that are going to massively encourage them and make them realize that they're doing good. So make sure that the recognition is well deserved and that you're not just giving it for anything because it becomes less... Um, less important to them. Otherwise, it needs to be important, okay? So recognize them, shout them out for everything they do, be their biggest cheerleader, support them. Do you know what? So many people do so much just for that bit of recognition, sometimes even over money. They don't get it often in the real world. So give them the pat on the back when the pat on the back is deserved. Keep a good track with them. One thing I'm going to say to you is, a lot of people are not going to bother you're going to sign people up and they may even pay the joining fee and then they may just fall off the planet of the earth. They might not ever speak to you again. You can send messages and they don't respond. Okay? Don't take it personal. I can tell you now, majority of people this happens to. Uh, well, everyone it happens to, but it happens with a lot of people. Okay? So don't take it personal. It's next. Okay? It's like, okay, this wasn't for you. Next. Always leave the door open because you never know. Timing could be an issue. It might not be. It's not right for them right now. But whatever it is, don't leave the door closed on them where they can't feel they can't come back to you. Always be there and open. Always check in on them. Even if you've gone months to them without speaking to them, give them a little nudge like, just seeing if you're okay, how are you? You know, without mithering. But guys, build that relationship. Tr track everything that they do. Keep good, good um, records so that you know where you're at and you'll build yourself a fantastic team if you consistently do this with each team member. So good luck with it, guys. OK, bye for now.